Erica Ledbetter, I'm from TSG Marine. We are an engineering company based in Hebburn. We have been going in our current form since 2012. Uh, we started um, when we were working with oil and gas companies in Aberdeen supplying a particular type of project which is called Walk to Work. Um, whereby the oil platforms require additional personnel which they can't house on the platforms. They put a vessel alongside and the guys essentially walk to work over a gangway. That's the way our business started. Um, we've diversified um, throughout the years in order to supply not just the walk to work packages but um, bespoke engineering packages, turnkey asset maintenance. We have a couple of products that we also supply. In this instance, we're talking about the um, exhaust replacement that we did in an offshore platform in the North Sea. Our client came to us after the exhaust had been damaged during a power outage. Um, the alternative was for a complete like-for-like -like replacement, which was very expensive for them, and the alternative vendor had suggested shutting down their platform, which would be uh, extremely costly and uh, cause them a lot of problems. So we were tasked with finding a solution that was no hot works because of the area on the offshore platform um, where the work had to be done. There was no crane access, so it was, that was one of our other big problems and this idea of, of putting it outside their shutdown window. Um, so we designed um, pieces of exhaust replacement in manageable sec uh, sections, pieces that could be manoeuvred without the crane, so in one and two metre sections. We also um, designed it in, in thirds, so 120 degrees. Um, so again, they were easily packed, easily transported and could be moved, uh, moved around the platform. Our words of wisdom would be look outside your own industry and your own knowledge. Go and, and be exposed to ideas from different industries and different environments. A lot of our ideas come from that sort of open-mindedness and, and the knowledge that you can gain from just even just from interacting with other people. Um, invest in your people, they're your biggest asset. Um, they, by investing in your people, allowing them to develop themselves and go out, as I said, speak to other people from other industries, you will bring those ideas back, back in-house. And also don't limit yourself in terms of um, employing people who've only worked in your industry. We have a big drive to employ people who are either graduates who maybe don't have the experience but bring amazing ideas or the ex-forces community where again they have an amazing skill set. They might have not worked in oil and gas but the things that they have done and, and seen in, in other environments bring a huge amount of value to our business. Innovation requires creativity and you're only going to get creativity if your people trust you uh, and they feel that they have the freedom to express their ideas. Um, so we actively uh, encourage our team to get to know each other um, and that's one of the ways we do that is through our Friday uh, lunch clubs where people uh, cook on a Friday and the team gets together and that allows you know uh, the cross-pollination of ideas and, and people to talk to each other but fundamentally people just to get to know each other. Mm -hmm.